Hey guys, this is Aubrey with Magical Journey Adventures and we are here at Tom Devlin's Monster Museum. We're gonna go ahead and check out some really cool monster artifacts and the history of different monsters that has been um, collected by uh, Mr. Devlin himself. So this is how you go to this uh, museum. You have to enter through this place, it's 1313. We're gonna go ahead and check it out. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so this is their merch. They have merch here. They have hoodies, which is pretty cool. They have t-shirts. $24.99 for this Wolfman t-shirt. And then they have this t-shirt here. Tom Dellen's Monster Museum. This like I got teeth and um, the wording here, which is cool. So over here they have face masks. All these different monsters, uh, monster masks from the count from here. They have the um, Chucky right here. And they have, this one might be from the Returning Living of the Living Dead here. Freddy. And they have some, um, and the magnets up here as well. See Boulder City, these are $5.99 for all these magnet pins, which is really cool. <coughs> they have these Chucky face masks down here. And then they have these like these uh, creepy tees, which is pretty cool. They have Halloween, Frankenstein, and The Exorcist. Well, they have some more up here as well. Some more different tees. Jason, handbags. Okay, so when you enter in here, this is a different room. They have different masks up here as well. Some um, autograph signing from Michael Myers. They have some posters. That's the restroom. Night of the Living Dead. They have a few other Halloween posters as well. All right, so located over here is some more different merchandise. They have pins, the monsters, there is Eddie. And then they have some more, these are some patches, which is pretty cool. They have plushies, the gremlins plush. And these are going for not sure how much these are going for. Wow. The Munsters posters up there. So as you walk through this way, they have some more. This is an arcade game. Now look at this. This is pretty cool. The zombie. Captain American zombie, which they actually had at DCA on Halloween. So this is their arcade room <clears throat> some more posters different arcade games pretty cool so over here they have a cinnamon sideshow and they have this here days of dead these are all the masks here they have some posters and look at this crazy spider from the Gremlins. I'm sure you guys remember this. So cool. All the webs. It's cool display. Spider Gremlin from the movie, The Gremlins. Some more posters in frames for sale. <laughs> they have these cool headbands, devil headbands. Okay, so coming through here is their theater. So they do have a theater in here where they sell different um, things here. They have popcorn and they have candy that they sell here. So this is a theater. It's a little dark. I apologize if you guys cannot see. But yeah, this is their theater. They have about three rows of seats about in here, which is pretty cool. 
Okay, so right now we're gonna get ready to enter the actual museum. Enter at your own risk. And here we go. So this is their monster museum. This is from the movie. Right here, one of the movies. Nosferatu. I don't know what this is. Nosfer Nosferatu, a symphony of horror. The Hunchback of Notre Dame. Lon Chaney. Lon Chaney himself, who created a lot of the monster makeups. Do not touch, please. The Creature from the Black Lagoon. The Wolfman. Frankenstein. The Wolfman. Lon Chaney Jr. The Mummy. <coughs> Boris Karloff. Monsters, there's Eddie Monster. There's another piece. We have Dick Smith who created the makeup effects for The Exorcist. And then here is Planet of the Apes. Makeup, John Chambers. <clears throat> I believe this was from the movie Aliens. Then as you keep going throughout this whole entire exhibit, they have different um, movies from the past. Now what is this? Trauma 3 Rules of Product. What is this one? Not sure what movie this was from. Safety team. Okay. We have more movies. Polter, Poltergeist. A few more movies that in makeup. So a lot of these uh, props were used in different parts of the films. Pretty cool. I think I remember this movie right here. I forgot the name of this movie. Puppet Master, that's right, The Puppet Master. And I remember The Puppet Master. All these puppets here. And then they have the Taloon. This is from The Puppet Master. If you guys remember that movie way back in the day, I definitely do. Okay, the Ghoulies. Cool. Okay, of course this is Killer Clowns from Outer Space. They're gonna actually have this, this scene at Universal Studios in Orlando, I believe. And I might be right if it's Hollywood. And then this is Obey. The live, okay, they li they live. Sorry, so I believe this is like an alien movie. They live. I don't remember this movie. I think I do from years past when I was younger. Oh, this one is the Toxic Avenger. The Toxic Avenger. I remember that in years past. <coughs> and if you keep going. Oh wow. Oh I remember this, the hills have eyes. And then they have the Fangoria. Michael Bailey Smith. Cool. And they have some more monsters. Clive Barber is the one who designed all the makeup effects. Hello. 
we have Jason. All the different Jason uh, props that were designed from the movie Jason. These are all the masks that were worn, which is pretty cool. And this is the one who designed his monstrous look, Kane Hooter, the one who designed and created Jason's look. And these just is all the history of all the different Jason effects, which is pretty cool, Camp Crystal Lake. Friday the 13th. <clears throat> Kinda creepy and pretty tall. <laughs> All right, well let's go ahead. Oh, this is Scream, Wes Craven. Let's go through this way. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre. All the different effects and props from the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, all the masks and props. This is the man himself. All right, now <clears throat> going through the rest of the museum, we're going to make our way out through the exit. So now coming through this way, behind the mask, Leslie Vernon, behind the mask, the rise of Leslie Vernon. Then we have some more different uh, props over here. Of course, I remember the leprechaun. Then we have the evil dead. Chucky, Halloween, Manic Cop, and then of course the Critters. Cool. Walking through this way is, I believe, Jason. No, oh, not Jason, Freddy. I think it's Freddy. <clears throat> yeah, Freddy Krueger, remember this scene? There's a lot of uh, pop and effects for Freddy. Lisa Wilcox, Freddy Krueger. It could be down here. Then we have Freddy himself. It's a lot of Nightmare on Elm Street history. So now, going through this way, we have Beetlejuice, cool. And then, we have it. <coughs> the undead, what is this, in need? Oh, Night of the Living Dead. Remember the little swamp <laughs> tin here. Oh, he was actually, oh, he was also, oh, he was actually the makeup for this gentleman too, Tim Curry. He did It, of course, you guys know this movie, and he also did this one too, I didn't know that. Cool. Creep Show, right here, Creep Show. And I already showed you guys Beetlejuice, this whole thing. All right, and this is the exit. Exiting out. So cool.